Hello, today we're going to have a go at putting this image onto this piece of wood, cutting it out with a straw saw. What I've done, I've altered things on these corners because I want to lower this circle bit down. So this is, the leaves stand out and then this brown section will be cut out of a MDF and then stuck on there afterwards. So it's the same procedure as before. Get your image on there. Like so, like I say, it's all going to be cut out. Stick it on with a bit of tape, just keeps it in place. Don't be too perfect. Throw your carbon underneath, and I start drawing. Now, a lot of people like to stick this straight to the wood. They can put the uh, painter's tape underneath and stick the image to that. I've tried it, it just don't work for me at all, I just don't like the idea, so I prefer just to use carbon paper and draw around it. So we'll draw around it all now, do the outer section, and then I can stick this to the MDF, because I have tried that before, and then I'll cut out this brown middle section, throw it all together, and see what we end up with. Okay, let's crack on. Okay, so we've drawn around that, I've done... All the bits that I need to on this. So we're going to cut all that out. This we don't need for now. But like I say, this I'll actually just stick straight onto the MDF on the next one. Because all we want to cut out is a brown section. So this, this can all go now. So we'll go and cut this piece out. And we'll see what we've ended up with. Okay, we're down to the last section. So we'll cut this piece out. And then we'll see what it looks like. Pop that little piece out there. Okay. Spin it round. Don't be afraid of turning it off and starting again. These fancy guys that spin it round and the leg looks so easy. Good on them, I'll say. Pick out the way that suits you. Take your time. Okay, that bit's done now, so we'll uh, give a little sand down and then we'll start fitting these out. I want to thin these right down these sides, thin this down, maybe half the thickness of that, so these leaves will stand out a bit more. Give it a good sanding over and we'll see how we're getting on. Okay, that's about finished that side of the uh, sign. Normally I'd like to go a router and just go straight round there and cut it in for the remaining wine bottle and the grapes. But as you can see, we're going to do that on some MDF. So we'll stick this down onto our MDF and then we'll get ahead and cut that down. 
Right, we've stuck our other piece down onto the MDF. Just using standard painter's tape, some spray, glue, and stick it on. Let that dry. So what we're going to do is cut out the brown section and then pop it on top of that piece. And we should be getting somewhere near. I'll just go and drill the pilot holes. These little holes that you're making here to feed the blade through on the fret saw. So I'll do them now while it's drying. Okay, we're on the last section now. As you can see, I've cut most of them out. These grapes were a nightmare. But I stuck with it, so we'll just cut this last piece out and we're on the own wood stretch. So off we go. Okay, oh, we've missed the bottom bit. I'll cut that off, we'll peel this off, and then we'll move on from there. I'll do that bottom bit. Okay, so we've got that section done. That's all nicely ready. We've cut our wine and grapes out. Obviously that's gonna sit on there. I'm gonna stain that darker so it stands out. Now the leaves, I was going to route in some veins or I actually tried cutting it out of this and it just don't I think there's too much going on so I'm actually just going to leave them like that and just stain them with some linseed oil and see how it looks don't want it too busy right we're about finished now I use a wood dye on the wine bottle and grapes deep mahogany it says there it's whatever's available in the shed it could have been a totally different colour uh, and boiled linseed oil for the backing and we're finished now it's all stuck down one big piece it's all finished with and that's that little project done i still say now that i need something on those leaves and i like i say i did attempt to cut out some vein effect and stain that the same and put that on afterwards i don't know it might just be too much going on there so for this video, we'll do away with that, and that's just finished. Thank you very much.